what is up youtube and welcome to another crib zone excursion if you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to hit that thumbs up subscribe for more <laughs> We have the rat with us. This is the homie blue, an American pit bull terrier. He's still a puppy, so he's still young. I couldn't bring crypto because the homie blue just wouldn't leave crypto alone. And it was mayhem trying to walk both of them. So I just brought blue and the rat. You guys did mention you guys wanted to see the rat more. So here he is. I'm pretty sure this is the first time that blue's been through these areas. We're just gonna let him explore a bit. I am looking forward to the reactions on people with me walking with the pit bull. I'm owning this dude for one day. Shouts out Mama Blue and Papa Blue for letting me borrow him. I'm taking pretty good care of him. Oh, that rat. There he is. There he is. Come on, that rat. Come on. <laughs> oh, look at his little face. If only I could have walked this dog like I walked YG and Crypto. I'll throw a clip of it right here. Jeez. <laughs> reaction on people with me walking a husky and a pit bull would be insane i'm gonna be going over what it's like to own american pit bull starting off with where these dogs originated from these dogs originated from england this is a medium sized dog breed just like the husky with short fur and a muscular body tone Beautiful. Look at that. <laughs> thank you <laughs> He just wants to go with everyone. Due to these dogs being extremely friendly towards everybody, they make really poor guard dogs, just like the Siberian Husky. Their friendliness towards people is insane. These used to be nanny dogs, since they were so friendly towards humans. That does not mean they are friendly towards other dogs. These dogs can be very dominant. You will need obedience training as well as socialize them at a young age. Since dogs reach puberty at around seven months, it's extremely important you socialize your dogs before those seven months. It's important that your dog gets his ass kicked by other dogs. If your dog doesn't get his ass kicked, he will not know what it's like to kick someone's ass or vice versa. So socialize your dog, let your dog get his ass beat. After he's learned what it's like to get beat up, if there's a situation where he does get into a dog fight, he will know when to stop. That's the main reason why you wanted to socialize your dog. Some characteristics about the pit bull, they're really strong dogs. They have really high confidence level, which is slightly part of the reason why people believe them to be aggressive. They're not aggressive, they're just really confident. If another dog wants to test their confidence, they will fight back. <laughs> Come on. Obedience training your pit bull is a must. These dogs are really good listeners. They strive to take your every command. Unlike the Husky, that is one of the biggest difference with the pit bull and the Husky is their obedience level. Here comes all the barks. These dogs are really good climbers. These dogs can be trained to jump for days. Call them LeBron James. Damn, I should have said that in the cringy ass rap battle. Their energy level, they do get really excited when they see someone. Other than their excitement, their energy level is pretty calm. Since these dogs have really short fur, it's really easy to groom these dogs. Look at that silky fur, man. Mm, mm. Keep walking, Blue. Don't fight back. A typical male can grow anywhere from 18 to 21 inches, weighing in at about 36 to 60 pounds. Their muscular build is really attractive to me. These dogs are all muscle. My child support senses are tingling. Bastard. Oh my God. Child support alert. I do believe 12 countries have restricted the ownership of the pit bull. Australia has a mandatory sterilization on the pit bull. I'm talking about 
child support declined. I love your dog. Thank you. Dog. So even if your pit bull seems to be okay with other dogs, as soon as they reach maturity level, they could just be triggered and be extremely dominant. So it's really important you socialize your dog. Okay. Oh yeah. Hi, Susan. Or him. I didn't even look him. Hi, yeah, it's baby. a guy. Hi, you're a little boy, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Hello. He freaking loves people. Hello. Hi. The pit? Yeah. Your pity? I used to have one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, oh. Come on. The American Pit Bull Terrier, the mix, was bred from bulls and from terriers, hence the name. These dogs were originally made for bull baiting. Since they banned it, the breed then became a dog fighting breed, which is slightly why these dogs can be so aggressive at points, since they do have fighting genes in them. So yes, these dogs were fighting dogs. Look at how bougie the rat walks. Get up, Blue. Get up. Oh, he can't get up. Get up. <laughs> no grip. Good boy. Blue. Just chilling. Nice. <laughs> Watch out, the rat. Just Let's go down, Blue. Let's go down, Blue. <laughs> what do you want? Why do you stand in front of me? If you could go up this, I'll be really impressed. Get up, Blue. Up, up, up. <laughs> yeah, nope. Overall, the American Pit Bull Terrier is a really good dog breed that needs a lot of obedience training, a lot of socializing to be able to be around other dogs. That run. Pit bulls aggressive. Cross the rut. Cross. Come on, the rut. Not all pit bulls are aggressive. They're just aggressive if they're aggressively raised. If you're looking to buy a pit bull, do your research. Do your training research to ensure that when you do receive your pit bull, that you're ready to be his master. I don't fall. Okay, that's enough of that. Blue here is five and a half months old. So he's still a puppy. He still has two months to reach maturity. This dog is always socialized at the dog park. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen him on my past videos. The rat! This dog has been featured on my channel a couple times. Thumbs up for having the homie Blue on the channel. The rat! Slow down! The rat! Ah damn, this dog is gonna get stepped on, man. He has no self-control. Come here! At least he listens. That's good. The rat! Pretty sure if I was to try and take this dog inside, even if he's on a leash, I would get a completely different response than I were if I took the rat. He just looks at me and keeps walking. I do notice that this dog is really attractive to people. He's really affectionate towards people, which is exactly why they make poor guard dogs. Possibly even worse than a husky. And I thought that was impossible. Good boy, dude. <laughs> Calm down. You're getting too excited. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Oh no. They were about to swoop our asses. You saw that VIP service? Damn. Come on, the red. You guys ready? Let's go. Let's go. Hi. Damn, that ass fat. A couple differences between American Pitbull Terrier and the Siberian Husky I've noticed. While walking them, even though Crypto does slightly pay attention to me, 
He still wants to take the lead. That might have to do with his energy level. But this dog, he looks back at me and he pays attention to where I'm going. Another difference I've noticed, I'm not sure if people like him more than they like crypto or if crypto just looks more intimidating or if he just matches with the rap perfectly. But people do really love the homie blue, man. They just love to pet him. It's probably the aura he gives, just him wagging his tail towards people, wanting to approach them. It's probably that Crypto really does not care for people. This dog is a way better people person than Crypto will ever be. That's exactly why they were nanny dogs. Savage. Is it warm? Wait your turn to rat. It appears that the rat has hit the VTEC. Oh no, he just wanted to piss on the fire hydrant. If you guys have more information about this dog, feel free to let me know in the comments. Happy to learn new things. Don't quote me on all this information. I'm not a professional dog breeder or anything like that. That's gonna go ahead and wrap up this video, guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Subscribe for more. Peace.